We're going to take a look at the Send to OneNote tool. Now, the tool isn't apparent right now. It's not really in there. You can take a look at the sys tray here, and it is right here, the Send to OneNote tool. I'm going to click on this, and you will notice that as soon as you launch OneNote, this automatically comes up. A couple things I want to point out. One, screen clipping. We have another session about screen clipping, so we'll leave that. Here, on the Send OneNote, notice that this is grayed out. What that means is we don't really have a place to send this yet. We have to have one of these Office programs open. You can see here we have Internet Explorer, Excel, PowerPoint, Word, etc. Then we have this, which is the new Quick Note. Now, I'm going to click on this and notice what happens. Right there. This is for if you have a quick thought, a quick idea. You want to quickly get it sent into OneNote before you launch OneNote and figure out where you're going to put it and all that. A quick note, as it were. A couple different things about this. One is you can notice it's kind of grayed out. We have the ellipses on the top. And if we click on the ellipses, we have the regular tabs. So this is indeed just kind of a regular note. However, it puts it in a different place. Let me just type something in here real quick. And I just said, this is a quick note. So there we go. We have it. Now, keep in mind, you can put anything in here that we've put in before. Images, video, and the like. So what we're going to do is we're going to close this. And then we're going to go find it. So where we find it, it is indeed in OneNote. So let's get there over here where it is right here quick notes I click on here there's your quick note so if you're looking through the quick notes and you are putting a lot of stuff in here it goes into the quick notes section and that's where it is okay now to get this not grayed out, what we have to do is we have to open some of these different Office applications. I'll come in here. I will go down. And what we're going to do is we're going to open up a few applications. Here we go. Word. And then we'll go right back in. And we will open up Excel. And there we are. Just open up regular things in here. It doesn't really matter. There we go. Now, when I click on this, you see what happens right there? It says Word. Here's the idea that you're in Word, you're in Excel, you're in Internet Explorer. You come across something, you want to save it. Well, you don't have to go within that program, within that application, to find where's the send to OneNote. You can just come down here. Notice it's Word. Now, if I have this as a focus, if I have Excel open, and as the focus, see what happens? It changes to Excel. Let me show you that one more time. Word, and there's Word, Excel, and there's Excel. So the idea is this, that I have this sheet here, I can click here, and boom, it puts it right into OneNote. So this is a look at using the Send to OneNote tool in OneNote.